Hi, and welcome to a lecture on multiple sclerosis. Multiple sclerosis is a potentially disabling autoimmune disease of the brain and spinal cord. Multiple sclerosis could be defined as a chronic neurologic disorder characterized by targeted destruction of central nervous system myelin as well as axonal degeneration and loss. Disease course. Patients usually experience a first neurologic event that is suggestive of multiple sclerosis known as clinically isolated syndrome. This event lasts for at least 24 hours with symptoms and signs indicating either a single lesion or more than one lesion within the central nervous system. With reference to pharmacologic choices, our discussion in this lecture will focus on disease-modifying therapies for multiple sclerosis. The first-line disease-modifying therapies include agents such as glatiramer and the interferons. Alternative disease-modifying therapies include alemtuzumab, natalizumab, dimethylfumarate, first-line disease-modifying therapies, glatiramer. Glatiramer acetate is an immunomodulator with effects similar to interferon beta. Glatiramer reduces relapse rates and MRI detectable lesion burden in relapsing remitting multiple sclerosis. Interferons Interferon beta is a standard first-line therapy option in the treatment of multiple sclerosis. Interferon therapy reduces the frequency of relapses and the size or number of lesions that are detectable on MRI. Interferon therapy also reduces the rate of conversion to clinically definite multiple sclerosis following an initial clinically isolated syndrome from about 45 to 50% to about 28 to 35% over 2 to 3 years.